Jesus Christ, the only Savior of sinners. Introduction What is your most distinct idea about Jesus Christ? If you consider him as different, in what specific way is he different? Common ideas Jesus is excellent moral example. Jesus is the greatest teacher who ever lived. Jesus is founder of the greatest religion on earth. The birth of Jesus Christ. How shall this be? Seeing that I know not a man. The Holy Ghost shall come upon thee, and the power of the Highest shall overshadow thee. Therefore, also that Holy Child, which shall be born of thee, shall be called the Son of God. His is a supernatural birth, because it was a virgin birth. Do you think there is an explanation for this? Or do you accept this as a supernatural act of God? What are the implications of Jesus' birth? In being born, he shares true human nature with us. In being virgin born, he is not like any human. He does not share humanity's sin. For we do not have a high priest who is unable to sympathize with our weaknesses, but one who in every respect has been tempted as we are, yet without sin. If you accept this biblical testimony to the uniqueness of Jesus, should this affirm or change your present view of him? The uniqueness lies in the one virgin born, Jesus himself, not in the virgin giving birth, Mary. Do you accept this? How does this bear upon Mary exaltation today? The person and mission of Jesus Christ. In the beginning was the Word, and the Word was with God, and the Word was God. The same was in the beginning with God. All things were made by Him, and without Him was not anything made that was made. John chapter 1, verses 1 to 3. Being in the form of God, He did not consider it robbery to be equal with God, but made Himself of no reputation taking the form of a servant. He humbled himself and became obedient to death. Therefore, God also has highly exalted him and given him the name which is above every name, that at the name of Jesus every knee should bow, and that every tongue should confess that Jesus Christ is Lord, to the glory of God the Father. Philipp From these passages, would you accept that? Jesus has all the character of God, and therefore he is God. Is this acceptable to you? Cite your reason of your answer. Jesus humbled himself for the purpose of saving sinners. His humbling himself involved becoming man in order to a. by himself obey perfectly the law. Galatians 4 colon 4 b 
take upon himself the punishment of the law. Obedient unto death as Philippians chapter 2 tells us. But when the fullness of time had come, God sent forth his Son, born of woman, born under the law, to redeem those who were under the law, so that we might receive adoption as sons. Concluding Reflection God's plan of salvation is unique. Would you agree that there is no salvation outside Jesus? Are you personally seeking or hoping for salvation outside of Christ? Would you mind sharing your thoughts? Thank you for your time and attention. Do you have any question? Hold me close till I get up. Thumb is barely out of sight.